Hey, I'm Cameron. Clint. Pizza Hut is rolling out a whole bunch of new stuff, and we're here to work our way through it for you. I'm glad they're changing. I mean, I think I am too. Yeah, I, I feel like there's only one way to go for Pizza Hut. Well, they can always go parallel. That's <laughs> true, yeah. Today we have the Cherry Pepper Bombshell Pizza from Pizza Hut. It's a cherry bomb pizza. On... Looks like new crust. Yeah, this is Asiago crust. Crushed tomato sauce on that. That sounds good to me. There's these Peruvian cherry peppers. That sounds intriguing. I like intriguing. It. Yeah, I was looking at those. Salami, balsamic drizzle. The balsamic drizzle is a, definitely a new thing there. Mm -hmm. This is supposed to have spinach on it. They gave me the pizza. They popped it open. I'm like, um, is this supposed to have spinach on it? And he looks at the instructions. He's like, yep. I'm looking at him and he's like, do you want me to put some on for you? And I'm like, yeah, that'd be great. Because they put it on I before. I would like it how I ordered it. Thank you. Yeah. And they don't and they don't cook it on there, so it's not like they'd have to remake it. They just throw yeah. it on until it's fresh on the end. So he comes back and he's like, we don't have any. I'm like, man, you guys are rolling yeah. this out. you got to be ready. But I guess it makes sense that for like a fresh topping, they'll be like, well, I'm sorry. We just... We, we don't have anything fresh here. So spinach is uh, <laughs> off the menu. They said, would you like olives or something instead? I was like, yeah, olives would be good. Oh, so olives don't come on it. No. Wow, that's gonna totally change the flavor, I think. Yeah, I, I don't, it's gonna be different because there's no spinach on it, so I don't really know what to do. I would like to comment on these olives. I know this doesn't typically have olives on it, but these olives are sliced so weird. To me, it looks like they're they're trying to hide that roaches might be hiding on the pizza. Like, oh, we'll cut them like this, we'll cut them in these weird oval shapes, the, and, and no one will know. Let's try Let's it out. Let's do this. That Peruvian pepper is interesting. I was going to say the balsamic. I was getting a lot of the balsamic. Mm -hmm. I like that. I feel like uh, the crust is pretty like doughy yes. and soft, but uh, flavor-wise, I would say improvement. I think it's pretty similar to the mm. crust, I mean, flavor-wise. Those Peruvian cherry peppers are uh, a nice addition to pizza. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like that kind of stuff, though. So Yeah, a little bit of spice, barely, though. I think that's from the peppers, or...? Yeah, yeah. You know what might actually make this better? Spinach. Spinach? Yeah, I like that crust better than their old crust for sure. It tastes balanced, but there's a lot of sweet in there. It's probably the balsamic and the peppers, I guess. Those salami slices are giant. There's not a lot of it on there, but they're huge slices yeah, they're of salami. Like tennis ball size salami. This is a, a new sauce there, crushed tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. I couldn't really tell. Uh, I couldn't tell either. I was actually looking for that. But there were so many other new flavors on it, is the thing. It, 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 True. It kind of got lost between the peppers and the balsamic sauce on there. That's pretty much what what you're getting. The crust is like some cheese bread when you're done eating. Yeah, fluffy. It's not super flavorful cheese, cheese though, I noticed. Yeah, it's kind of like very mellow Asiago. Yeah, kind of interesting combination of flavors. I think for the first time ever with the Pizza Hut pizza, I would say, like, I would order this. As far as the new things that we're checking out here, Balsamic glaze, approve. Peruvian cherry peppers, approve. approve. And this new Asiago crust, approve. As far as the sauce, there's a stamp on there. As far as the sauce, uh, undetermined, because there's not much yeah. flavor. You'd have to get like a cheese pizza to really get into the sauce. I'm not willing to do that. The funny thing is though, is I think that people that go to Pizza Hut a lot probably be like, what's with these new pizzas, man? These are getting out of yeah. control. So I think we should go ahead and rate this. All right, on a scale of 1 to 37. 26 out of 37. I'm going to go with a 30 out of 37. Thanks for tuning in to the Two Minute Reviews. The Two Minute Reviews.